German Max Style Miner here. Today I bring you a quick tutorial on how to change your texture pack on Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.9.0 stroke 1 and stroke 2 depending on when you're watching this. So before we start you will need a couple of apps. You will need Explore which is a free app on the Play Store. You will need Zipson again a free app. ES File Explore or some other file manager you will need. Plus, you will also need a Minecraft Pocket Edition APK file. I uh, you need it, but what I do say is please, please, please buy the app. They put a lot of work in, especially the 0 0.9.0, and I think they deserve the app. And just so you can see, if we go to my thing, I have purchased the official app. So it is there, but we do need a APK file, which I will leave a link in the description if not through a torrent site but i'm sure there are other easier ways to find and if i can find other links i will link them in the description as well right so we have our file managers let me just see if i've got my apk file go to downloads yep there's my apk file so that's brilliant right now we need a texture pack so if you go to mcpe universe universe.com <clears throat> it will bring you up on this all this is can be done on a Android device and no computers needed it is not root even though mine is this does work without root go to the navigation bar and go to textures mine's already on it so there's only a few at this point in time but we are going to go for the OCD texture pack ported by FV Disco so shout out to him so let's just wait for this to load up Okay guys, after an absolutely attorney, we have got onto the OCD texture page. So we scroll down until we hit the download and we click download. It will bring you up another thing. I'm using Chrome by the way, because it's just what I like to use. So we wait for it to load up a little bit more. So I will back you in a second. Okay, yeah, as you can see, it was popped up with the thing. I always go for Chrome because ES Downloader sometimes doesn't work. So I always like to do it. And you shall see in a second, we are on Dropbox. So click the download link. Again, click Chrome. And then you'll see at the top of the screen, a arrow will come down saying it is now downloading. So we'll come out of that and wait for this to download. And it's done. This is where ES File Explorer comes in for me. <laughs> You can, I believe, do it straight from the zip folder, but I prefer to do it to get the folder right. So highlight that, click on the more, and extract to. Click the top one, and it will extract the folder into your downloads folder. Like so. So there is our folder. Right now we go on to explore. <clears throat> Excuse me, my voice, my voice is very crackly though. I'm coming down with a cold which is a lot of sucky stuff right in the explore folder god damn bloody thing okay wait we are in downloads so we want to open the ocd file click again and then click on the android one and click on assets scroll across until we find the minecraft pocket edition apk file that I downloaded earlier and will be in the link so you should have it as well so we'll click onto that scroll to the bottom and open as a APK now we, if we click on the top it will then, then slide back and we click copy it will then copy the assets file from the OCD into the Minecraft Pocket Edition APK file so click OK it should come up as it has done it's saying file already exists if you want to overwrite so click do this for all and overwrite so this will take just a second or two just to copy all the files into your newly opened minecraft pocket edition 0.9.0 and it is done and for that bit that is done now we need to sign the file so we it can be used as an apk so Go to zip signer again link will be in the description choose in the night port and then go to where you've 
put your Minecraft Pocket Edition APK file. Mine is here. And then make sure the auto test key is under key mode and then click sign the file. <coughs> it will then start. <coughs> Excuse me. It will then start signing it. This will take a second or two, not long at all. And it is done. So come back out of there. I'm going to go back into the ES file manager. Again, it's only personal preference. There is other very good ones out there. Now you'll find you'll have two Minecraft Pocket Edition APK files. One is a normal and one is assigned. To get the texture pack version, you click on the signed one and then click install. It will take a second to install. Let me just get rid of them while well, as written. It will take a second to install. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Maybe a couple more seconds. Anyway, how are you liking Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.9.0? Would you like a regular texture pack review on this site? If you do, let me know in the description below or on Twitter at MaxStarMining. Anyway, let's. We've opened up the file. We click play, and if we go to texture pack, we will. What the? Heck? We will see. It has all changed. So you can now see, we now have a 0 0.9.0 OCD texture pack in all it is glory and it looks very nice indeed. And if we have a scoop around here, you can see all the blocks. This will be my texture pack view. I didn't make this myself. Uh, a chap on the Minecraft view, uni MCPE universe form did make it. I will link him in the description, so big shout out to him. So as you can see, we have all the mobs down here as well. The skeleton, the zombie, and not much has changed on them. Some of the others, they have changed. So there are the mobs. So yes, I will do a texture pack review very shortly. But let's come out of this one. <coughs> and I'll quickly show you it in game. So I'll go on to my survival world that I play off camera. So, and then we can have a look and see what it looks like in game. As you can see, it looks very different from the original. The pumpkins, this is my farm by the way. It looks very different indeed. But yes, this is how you get texture packs on Minecraft Pocket Edition 0 0.9.0. So I hope you like this video. If there's any problems, hit me up in the comments and I'll try to answer them as quickly and as uh, promptly as possible. Thanks for watching. Please smash that like button. Show me that you like my videos and I'll bring you some more content and some more text pack reviews and let's plays and seashells and other toys. Or you let me know what you want to see on this channel and I will do my best to bring them to you. So on that note, thank you for watching and goodbye.